Temperatures this morning warmer than they were yesterday morning when we were in the teens and 20s. Now we are in the 30s, or we were in the 30s, excuse me. We did warm up today to 44, which is 10 degrees below normal, 47 yesterday. It's been a chilly week after being in the 50s this past weekend. And the temperatures are going to be very similar uh, to what we had last weekend, this coming weekend, but more sunshine and uh, a li less rain. We had more rain last weekend, if you recall. Uh, temperature right now, that's the wind chill, 33 in Milwaukee. It feels like 37 in Beaver Dam and 38 in Burlington. The wind has died down significantly, but it just it feels better without that gusty wind that we had earlier. Still a few sprinkles and maybe even a few flurries on the radar. The flurries up around West Bend and uh, Kewaskum, maybe even southwest corner of Sheboygan County down there by Waldo. Uh, maybe we should, we should go to Waldo sometime, yeah, up in Sheboygan County. Um, so all this is moving out overnight tonight and we will see uh, the clearing happening and by morning you'll see the sunshine all that clearing back into Minnesota Iowa the Dakotas that will be here throughout the day for tomorrow so a lot of folks wondering about yard work because the grass is greening up getting a little bit longer and do some raking and stuff good for tomorrow Sunday I gave fair because of the chance of morning rain Monday and Tuesday look to be good as well and you might as well if you're firing up the uh, lawnmower you might as well fire up the motorcycle as well uh, green light for tomorrow that is a 60. That's a 60. It's going to be windy. Hold on to that bike. Uh, yellow light for Sunday just because of that slight chance for some morning lingering showers. And then Monday and Tuesday look great for riding as well. Uh, there's this forecast for tonight. By tomorrow morning, sunshine, a southwest wind picking up at 10 to 15. That wind picks up quickly before noon. We'll see gusts throughout the day, 20, 30, 40 miles per hour. And then here comes that light rain. It's from a weak cold front that will push through late Saturday night, early Sunday morning. Still some lingering showers early Sunday. And then throughout the day, we'll clear out, but look at the wind direction north to northeast at 10 to 15. So obviously it's off the lake, so it'll be a little cooler on Sunday, but still not bad for tonight. A little frosty in the morning with temperatures in the low to mid 30s. The wind starts picking up quickly tomorrow morning, so get that walk in quick. Uh, the wind really not that big of a deal. It's just going to be gusty, but it's going to be upper 50s to around 60 degrees throughout the day tomorrow, even at the lakefront because the lake breeze is shut off. That northeast wind returns on Sunday after some morning showers, a high of 51 in sunshine, 58 and windy once again on Monday. You could see gusts around 30, Tuesday cooler at 50, and look at Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Yeah, there's a chance for showers with temperatures close to 60 degrees. Not bad, not bad.